Hurricane Michael has left the Florida Panhandle a massive mess. The deadly storm has claimed the lives of at least six people, and rescue crews warn more lives may be in danger as the storm continues to move throughout the United States. Natasha Chen has the latest on the destruction from Panama City. Michael left a trail of devastation. Our lives are gone here. The deadly storm made landfall near Mexico Beach, Florida. It packed winds of 155 miles per hour, becoming the strongest storm to hit the continental United States in more than 25 years. Every restaurant's gone, every store's gone. Cars, furniture, even houses tossed all over town. The coastal city now looks like a war zone. You know, all of these all of their lives are cold here, you know, so how do you, how do you, what do you do, you know, what do you store? Peppered throughout the panhandle, pain and destruction. Oh God, Panama City. There's nothing there, nothing. It, it, I never seen nothing like it. Across the southeast, Michael uprooted trees and downed power lines. More than a million people are without power and many can't get cell service. Michael moved to the Carolinas and Virginia where flash floods are turning roads into rivers. This area, already battered by Hurricane Florence, is not getting a break as Michael continues its catastrophic path. I know that we grow weary of the wind the rain and the floods, but we must remain cautious and alert.